Hey there, Disney Infinity fans. Welcome to Toy Box TV Top 5. It's me, Scott. And Allison over here. And I'm Tyler. And today, we'll be counting down the winners of the ever so anticipated Imagineering Challenge. You guys really let your imagination shine in this one. We asked you to build your very own ride or show inspired by the Disney parks. We saw a lot of amazing toy boxes. There were roller coasters, there were storybook rides, and more. Now keep those arms and feet inside the vehicle and buckle up. Let's take a look at number five. Let's go! Woo! <laughs> Our number five toy box takes us to the practically perfect land of tomorrow with Professor Tom Morrow and his unpaid intern, Mighty Jidas. Congrats to InfiniFan 1927 with his toy box, Teacup to Tomorrowland. Professor Tom Morrow has a great new invention. It's the Teacup 9000, which is designed to take its passengers to Tomorrowland, fuel up on churros, mm, water, and dings, and get ready to blast off. Looks like the Teacup 9000 is taking us the long way to Tomorrowland. Pass through the Jurassic period, the medieval times, the Wild West, and more before finally reaching your futuristic destination. We really liked how this ride isn't your traditional Disney Parks attraction. And of course, Mighty Jidus' sassy commentary was totally hilarious. Great job on this one, Infinifan 1927. Congratulations. If you had the chance to change a fate, would ya? <laughs> Number four takes us to the Kingdom of Dunbrock for a fun target challenge. Let's check out Merida's Brave Adventure by Vasuri83. Go on a journey with Merida as she discovers her fate on this brave inspired attraction. Shoot the targets along the way and try to climb up to the top of the leaderboards. Hmm, sounds like it was inspired by a Disneyland attraction that we all know and love, Buzz Lightyear's Astro Blasters. I love the different approach that the Vasuri's took with this one. I love how the ride also tells the story of Brave while you interact with the environment around the story. Congratulations on another amazing toy box, guys. Congrats. Our number three toy box imagines five attractions that this toy box artist would love to see in a Disney park. Let's take a look at Disneyland Infinite Possibilities by Diz Explorer 3 Welcome to this toy box Disneyland dream. Step inside this theme park and experience five attractions based off of five of Diz Explorer's favorite Disney and Disney Pixar films. Princess and the Frog, Brave, Tangled, Fantasia, and Treasure Planet. I'm a huge Rapunzel fan, so obviously the Tangle ride was my favorite. It's a high-speed roller coaster where you must escape from Maximus in the Palace Guards so that Flynn Rider can help Rapunzel fulfill her dream. I think my favorite was actually the Treasure Planet attraction. Pilot your ship through the galaxy to find the treasure on Treasure Planet. It follows the story of the movie, so the treasure sets off the planet to explode if someone tries to take it. Yikes. Well, the biased Louisiana in me says that the Princess and the Frog Dark Ride was my favorite. When Ray draws the heart around Evangeline, it makes me tear up a little bit. Aw, all these attractions were great. Does Explorer, you never cease to amaze us with your infinite imagination. Now, let's journey to a land of mystery and rainbow puke. Our number two toy box this week goes to toy box artist team Sumerian and Pirate Steven with their toy box Gravity Falls Mystery Ride. Welcome to Gravity Falls. Explore the wonders and mysteries of this weird land. You'll encounter bottomless pits, puking gnomes, the mystery shack, and more. What really made this toy box stand out was that Sumerian and Pirate Steven actually designed the camera to turn when you press the shoulder buttons so that you can view the attraction from different angles. So cool! We also love the comedic narration by none other than Dipper Pines. Wonderful job on this one, guys. This one was so awesome. Okay, are you ready for the best of the best toy box for the Imagineering Challenge? Number one went above and beyond our wildest imagination and created a land that I would totally love to visit in real life. Let's give a big congrats to... Our Daddy, Daddy 3. 3! With this super cool toy box, Imagining a Hercules Land. It's time to create a new land in the Toy Box Disneyland. And with a little help from an Imagineer, discover a whole new land for one of the most famous Disney heroes, Hercules. There's so much you can do in Hercules Land. Ride the underworld drop, watch a parade, ride a carousel, watch the nighttime spectacular waterworks show, and even more. Don't forget about the dark ride Zero to Hero, which takes you through Herc's story as Phil trains him to be a true hero so they can reunite with his father Zeus in the godly kingdom of Olympus. You guys, there's literally so much to do here, I don't even know where to begin. I know, right? Great job, guys. This is sure to be the theme park of the week in every Greek opinion poll. Oh, I like what you did there. <laughs> Congratulations, guys. This week's rising star is heavily story-driven, and it totally works. Congrats to The Wicked Home by Katie S. 
Okay, so a new ride is needed for the Halloween Town exhibit, but picking this haunted house for the scary experience might be going too far. Be afraid. Better yet, be horrified. The backstory of this mansion is that a young couple purchased the land. Years later, the young man's wife and children mysteriously vanished. This toy box definitely gave me chills. It reminds me of a more sinister version of the ever infamous Haunted Mansion. Congratulations, KDS. Yeah, very nice job on this toy box. Keep it up. So are you guys ready for your next challenge? Your next challenge is the holiday challenge. Get in the holiday spirit and build a toy box inspired by whatever holiday you celebrate this time of year. Be it Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, Star Wars The Force Awakens, or National Lemon Cupcake Day. Mm, National Lemon Cupcake Day? Yeah, it's actually on December 15th. That's right, all right. So all the toy boxes for the holiday challenge are due by Wednesday, December 16th at noon Pacific time. Don't forget to include hashtag holiday challenge in the description of your toy box so we can find it. Good luck. Okay, all right, time's up. Controller's down and it's time to announce the winner of the November Leaderboard Challenge. It was a tight race, but ultimately the top score for Arlo's Dino Dash goes to... Bella, Bella Play 16. 16. With a score of one minute and 10 seconds. Wow, Arlo must have been getting some serious cardio. Congrats. Yeah, awesome job, Bella Play 16. We also have five more players topping the leaderboards. Helpbird35182, Murr, Bubbomb75, Disney Infinity H, and AL223. Congrats, guys. Now it's time to jump into the next challenge. The December leaderboard challenge is called Midnight Movie Madness. You gotta help 20 super fans be the first to see the big December 18th film. Hmm, I wonder what film that could be. How fast can you get them all inside the movie theater? Right now, the top score is held by Mike17. The challenge is over at the end of the month, so you have the entire holiday break to top the leaderboards of Midnight Movie Madness. Good luck, everyone. Okay, everyone, that's all we have for this week's Top 5 episode. Thank you so much for watching. Check back every week because we have Toy Box TV every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And keep climbing your way up to the top of the leaderboards for Midnight Movie Madness. The top score will be shared in Toy Box TV at the end of the month. Until next time, and remember, if you can dream it, you, you can, can do, do it. it.